Slash in half. Go away now. Yeah, boy. Right, let's go check out what these things are. I know what path they're talking about too, though. But I just these have triangles, so. And clearly, the triangles mean everything in this game. Let's walk through some bushes. Out. Oh, oh, it's another guy. We approached a lo collection of graves in a thicket side of the old road where we met a few ghosts who seemed friendly. Hi, ghosts. They look like farm people. The glowing ghost who spoke was a giant we knew from the old stories whose famous portrait demanded obedience. Last year before the Eulatide, I assembled a posse and we set out to reassemble the Trigon Trifecta. We had heard about the gateway to the infinite, infinite at the summit of Mingita and we thought it sounded like something cool to see. So anyways, attend the gold trigon and scoped out, scoped out the trigon of Grove before setting out to locate the bright moon trigon, which is the one I'm on. Locating the bright moon trigon didn't go so well. We got totally lost, to be honest. So I realized the, si the significance of the lunar cycle and its influence on the sprites of slumber in the twilight realms. Twilight realms, or whatever. Um, twilight realms, yeah, probably. Uh, that's when we saw it here and began to monitor the moods of the moon so we might learn when to... When to be, where, and how. We died of boredom waiting around <laughs> for the moon to change. Okay, actually, we died because of an argument we had because of boredom. I don't really want to go into it right now, if you don't mind. Okay, so what happened was that one of our posse was cheating, was a cheating cheater, and we caught him red-handed. A fight broke out, and the cheating cheater f fled up the old road towards a perilous precipice. So then we were just hanging out, wondering what to do, when all of a sudden, the Gogolithic Mac showed up. Yikes. Okay, so the Gogolithic Mac killed them, because the red-handed- <laughs> Fucking A, again? Go away! I don't know why he keeps doing that, because now Minky Tower is going to come again. Like that, like just like that. Or, uh, whatever. Hey, leaving. Leaving, hey, leaving, leaving. Oh, damn it! I don't care about your little statues. Wow, I actually blocked that. What? <laughs> Come at me. Statue defeated. Derelict wins. Victory achieved. Alright, get out of that. I don't think I know where the key goes, but they're talking about the the moon thingy. I don't know about that. That might be tricky. Might be a bit tricky. It's right over here. Check that out. Yeah, because there's a locked door right there. Yeah, I saw this over here. Okay. I don't know if I was recording. I think I should have been, because I record every time I play this. But Hello! On a side path leading away from the old road was a stone card with a series of previously indecipherable lunar pictograms. The pictograms were referred to a secret place located nearby, where the moods of the moon could be altered. The moon grotto? Which is probably in here. That door is actually pretty big. And creepy. Alright, open it. Nice. Oh, that's fantastic. Why does this place look really scary? Whoa. Uh, what? Uh, what? Hello? Um, what's happening? Whoa! Holy poop! I 
Oh, I see. Oh, there's just no moon. What's this say? Time paradox. Um, <laughs> uh, Moon I wonder how long this time paradox will last. Um, what am I supposed to change it to? Okay, well, how about we start with this one? No, no. Let's start with this one. Which would be... Stop. On... I'm gonna have to check this all the time now. Um, time paradox. Why is it, why is it saying time paradox? What's going on outside, then? Nothing. Why is it... Time Paradox! What are these people saying? I don't know what the fuck is going on. Uh, see, now it's like that. Like I said it. What the brown is going on? Does anyone have anything like to offer me like help or? Oh great. <coughs> the hell was that? Is it Mingy Cow? Yeah. Or the Gogolithic math? Math? Oh, I hate math. I hate math, new math, so whatever. Why don't you come at me, bro? I guess I have to. Oh, damn. Hey, guess what? Oh, fuck. these freaking fairy things. Uh, I'm gonna die too. So I don't know what that even fucking means, that other thing. Like, I changed the thing near the moon, and it's like, only, st only it can only be found with, like, the bright moon changing? I don't fucking know. Well, that's what the key does anyway. You change this thing as a moon, and you said we need to go, you know, seven sprites, but uh, to find the next thingy. But I don't know what the, the word. Oh God! Hey, hey, people! Hey, wait, wait, wait! Let me talk to them. Let me talk to them. I need to heal too. So. Uh, uh. Okay. Right. 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 Click. 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 Oh, that's a dream world. Okay. Alright, oh, alright. Okay, I see. I gotta go back to the dream world. Shut up now, I'm leaving. I know what I have to do. I gotta go back to the dream world. God damn it. No, no, no. Fuck. Go before the asshole comes. Go. Run. Alright. 
So we're gonna back into the dream world. What happens if I did it wrong? What happens if I have to go back? Or why does it keep saying time paradox? I don't even know. <laughs> you guys have anything useful to say? Girl or log fella? Tommy twice game. Right, let's go back and see if we can do anything. If not, then we're freaking screwed. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Cause I don't wanna go back here after every day. Like after I change the moon every time. Cause that's why I chose the moon. Right, click, click. Austin. Damn it. All right, that means I gotta like, go pretty soon. All right. Uh, come on, Flippy. Give me the Flippy flip. Great! Who cares? Oh, we're back in Dream World! Welcome to Inception once again. Great. Man, I started off a lot more enthusiastic about this, but this is getting fucking tiring. Like, of not knowing what to do. Resident Evil, you always have objectives. That's kind of what I like. You have an objective in this too, but it's just not as straightforward. Okay, go over there. Okay, kid. Kid. Oh, I need that effort. My dear, bye. Hello. Uh, what you got to say, buddy? I don't know your purpose here. You just play a weird. Hello. Great. I don't know, should I go sit down next to him? I feel kind of bad. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I'll just take my shroom. I don't even know. Oh my god. I don't know what I should do. Huh. <sighs> I don't know what I'm doing. I noticed that I came back here and the campfire man and the grizzly boog or boar were like here. <sighs> Believe. Hello. It's like go anywhere now. <laughs> oh, epilepsy! Ah, I can't. That hurts your eyes. Hey, look! There's nothing here yet again. Ah, I might have to call it because uh, I'm tired <laughs> of this game right now. I had a long day too. I had like an eye appointment, haircut. My hair's all short now, and it's weird. It's, it's been really hot out. I've only been on the computer for maybe... I don't know what time is it? It's 8.30. What the hell did I just do? Okay, great. I'm gonna call it here because I'm freaking tired. So, let's see how far I am. Do I just, or do I just end it? Yay! How far am I? I am... Oh, it shows no Christmas. Sixty percent. All right, so we only got four more percent in that sitting. But next time on Super Brother Sword Sorcery, we hope we get farther. My name is Jared. Thank you for watching this. I got. Hey, that's not like I'm not getting achievements out of this. Look at that. Two more. What's this? Dark Moon Rock. Sh oh, that sounds awesome. All right, next time we're gonna hopefully find out what that is. But uh, for now, look forward to the more uh, indie games and. Um, is some um, hopefully gonna be done with this pretty soon. 
at forty percent, but it's pretty fun. I like it. I, I really love the music. It's awesome. Goodbye.